here's a letter dated May 28th, 2022, sent out to parents in the Foston, Minnesota School District from Superintendent Sue Richards Chase. Quote, I regret that I must write to you today to inform you of another recent situation involving extremely inappropriate and disrespectful imagery created by some of our high school students. Specifically, we are aware that a video created during a school-sponsored lock-in shows some students dancing and mimicking Indigenous Americans. I will repeat it. Hate has no home in our school district. Instead, ours is a district that respects and celebrates all cultures. We are committed to ensuring a safe, welcoming, and positive learning environment in our schools. This is a commitment we take very seriously and will continue to hold our students to high standards. It is important to note that while school is not in session now, those students in the video will face appropriate disciplinary action per district policy. Because the situation involves students, we cannot share further details due to our legal obligation to protect student confidentiality. Thank you for your attention to this important communication, unquote. Again, that was from the superintendent of Foston Schools, Sue Richards Chase, who ironically on May 19th sent out another letter to parents admonishing a student uh, for a photo that had been uh, circulated on social media depicting an incident that occurred uh, at the high school. The photo shows uh, one student with their knee on the neck of another student with a caption that refers to the murder of George Floyd. I'm Neil Carlson reporting for inews.tv.